And hey, Sona. Hi, Conan. How are you? Yeah, I'm okay. Yeah? You feeling all right? No, I'm not. I'm very pregnant, but I'm okay. I'm okay. You are incredibly pregnant. I found out today I have two babies that are both weighing over six pounds. Wow. I'm carrying 12 pounds of just human. That sounds like they're fully clothed in utero. <laughs> they're wearing heavy corduroy jackets. <laughs> and they've got work boots on. That's 48 McDonald's quarter pounders. Yeah. Good <gasps> God. Oh, now I want McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> but um, that's that's a lot of baby. Yeah. I will compliment you. And Matt, you will back me up on this. You have visited the show a couple of times recently. Yeah. You're not allowed to drive, uh, but your very nice, cool husband, Tack, drives you. And you'll visit us on the set. And everyone says the same thing. You have two babies and they're all concentrated in this one area of your body and the rest of you just looks amazing you just huh. look not that i mean it's true it, and all the women are freaked out they're like oh my god if you just you know didn't know yeah if you didn't look at that one part of your body where it looks like someone is trying to hide um i'll just say it uh one of those mini fridges <laughs> Under your under your dress. Oh, you um, really romanticize pregnancy. Yeah. Yeah. Well, instead of you know some Coors Light, you've got two twenty six pound babies in you. Um, but no, but you're uh, you really look amazing. Well, That's what I'm saying. Very much. It took me a it's long really time to get there, but no, everyone says that. it. You look very beautiful. That's very nice. I feel like I kind of actually maybe lost weight, but uh, yeah, which is weird. But I'm cool. I feel like I'm crushing it, and uh, yeah, I'm just ready. You're ready. This is the stage I remember my wife both times being very ready towards the end. Like, I think she said, get this monster out of me. Yeah. Is what she I'm said ready. several times. I'm ready. Yeah. <laughs> Sleeping, moving, doing anything. I'm ready. Right. And what about you, uh, Matt? I'm good. I'm hanging in there. I mean, I'm no champ like Sona. You're an inspiration, Sona. You okay. look amazing. And it's incredible all you do during all of this. Thanks, man. You're I think welcome. Nice science is going to make moment. make it possible for a man to carry a child. Mm, I would why? love to. I no. would love to. Would you? Yes, I would. I'm kind of jealous. I'm going to be very honest. I'm not jealous at all. <laughs> I think you're insane. Really? The miracle of childbirth? Yeah, but- I just, I, I'm just freaking me out right now, just thinking about it. Gorley, think about you carrying a child. Um, yeah, think about it. Yeah. I waddle in. Uh -huh. I, I sit down and I go, oh, oh hi, guys. <laughs> well, that's not that different from what you do now. <laughs> I know, that's true. You don't really waddle, but you're... <laughs> not, oh, my God. This transformation that you just went into is the first man to give <laughs> it birth. Shows how Nothing. little I know. Let's see, Yeah. <sighs> Hi guys. Yeah. No, I um it is of course the miracle of life. It twins. is twins. Twins. And you're going to instantly have these two humans. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. am. Um any thoughts about uh what they might look like? Do you ever try and picture them? I think they're gonna be two little hairy Armenian babies. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> I, I don't know how to they're gonna be, you know, like Olive skinned. Mm -hmm. They're going to have a, a lot of hair. You make it sound like they're going to be born fully bearded. <laughs> Are they going to have thick beards? <laughs> Eight pounds of that 12 is yeah. just hair. <laughs> yeah. They could be. They could have beards by the time they're like two, I think. I don't know. Wow. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> they'll be born and then like literally three hours later, they'll have to shave. <laughs> the nurse is here. No, I'm fine. I can breastfeed. No, no, no. She's here to shave them. <laughs> She's just wearing a barber's smock. Yeah, she's, yeah, she's like, I don't take care of that. Uh, and the baby's like, <laughs> what are you reading the papers? Um, You're going to want to eat hummus instead of breast milk. I was When I was born, my mom said that I was a fat little Buddha, a little fat baby. <laughs> oh, wow. And she said that I had uh, bright orange wispy orangutan hair that was like oh, sticking straight up. adorable. Oh. Yeah. Did oh she God. say it in a loving way or was she like, I was horrified? No, she was not horrified. Oh. But I was the only uh, one. There's, um, you know, six siblings in yeah. my family and I was the only one with that kind of uh, orange copper hair. Mm. 
And so it was, you know, was, even when I showed up, you know, people were like, what's this all about? You know, there's a buzz that went through the hallway. Oh, come on. And people were like, this kid's going to do things someday. Ugh. Someday he's going to have a podcast. I was a, a really ugly baby and my mom cried when she saw what? me. What? Really? Yeah. And she loves telling me this story, which is, I don't know why, but- she, she cried because she thought I was ugly. And then the nurse was like, she's not always going to look like that. <laughs> I'm preparing you. Things can get mushed around a little bit. Um, my daughter, when she was born, was absolutely beautiful, just stunningly beautiful. And my son is a very handsome young man, very good looking guy. Yes, he is. And, um, but when he was born, you know, it's, it's quite a traumatic process. And the face is very malleable when the child is born. <laughs> so um, uh, I got a look at the baby and so did uh, Liza. And uh, we were, we were uh, concerned. <laughs> Because he looked like Ed Asner after a bar fight. <laughs> he really did. God. Looked like oh he had gone, God. like he had fought off like six people. He looked like an angry old sports writer uh, who had tried his hand at boxing and it hadn't gone well. That's what he looked like. Oh my God. And we were just like, oh, well, I'm sure he'll be a kind person. <laughs> oh my God. And then um, literally within like three days, he started to look completely different. <laughs> And I, I was like, oh, right. You know, the, the, tr the trauma of childbirth. Oh I was going to say, thank God he has no memory of that, but you've recorded it here for all time. Oh, no. I, every day I tell him, man, when you first, I mean, every day at breakfast, he'll show, he'll, he'll arrive and I'll say, man, when you showed up, you were just a hot fucking mess. <laughs> oh, God. And then I'm like, waffles? 